Hello, 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 and welcome back again to another Destiny 2 video. I'd like to apologize for the big gaps in between these videos, but I think we can come to an agreement that it's to be expected. I've been attempting to make promises about trying to be as regular as possible about it, but I, I'm obviously not very good at that. So... Here I am, I finally got my sister and my friend together once again. We all have had different things happen in our lives recently. That has kind of prevented us as well as my laziness. <laughs> but once again, we have my sister, Brianna. Hola, niños. And we have our friend, Robert. Hello, hello, hello. And, unlike the last video, we're hoping to actually do something together, and hopefully without any interruptions. Because last time, my internet was crapping out, didn't want to behave, so I had to splice two videos together just to get that last video to work. But, we'll find out. So, now heading on with the game here, in the previous video we found out that one of the greatest characters in the game, as most people will also agree, as these two right here would too, Cade 6, right? I got his number right, correct? Cade 6? Yeah. Yes, we don't have to shoot you. <laughs> <laughs> he has uh, sadly passed away in the game. Which, I'm sure many people already know this, because, you know, this game's been out for a while before I even played it. I'm just recording usual stuff, but... He was, he was a comical character, and probably one of the only other characters that I could get attached to. I, I don't play Destiny that often, and that's obvious, as we've spoken just a moment before. But... Cade 6 was definitely one of the more lovable characters due to his comical outgoing and uh, his silly nature and to getting into trouble when, uh, you know, he could take a more reasonable method of uh, attack or defense, you might say. So, we're to speak to the Vanguard. We'll see what he has to say. I thought you'd be gone by now. Papa I would Papa. attempt to dissuade you from your course. Oh. But it would only insult us both. As it stands, we've okay, got every out. available guardian dealing with escapees from the prison of elders. <laughs> it's still not enough. If you go to war with the Reef, it's a war you will have to fight alone. The Vanguard cannot help you. I think he's speaking about something of the current era and not the DLC in which we are enacting upon right now. That's something that we might get confused, is that these characters will speak of the current DLC and expansion, and we'll probably hear bits and pieces of that. All right, we're gonna head off over here. Speak to uh, this warlock, I forget her name. I Kore. Uh, what can you teach me? It's been some time since we last spoke. Hope you're well through hope, it seems, has little wake in this turbulent time. No. <laughs> Though hope it seems has a little wake in this turbulent time. I find myself trying to resist the urge to theorize or apply motive, though I feel ensnared by the temptation to do so. Core expels a deep breath. There's a reason behind all of this. Order, clarity, somewhere. Ikora shifts to look at you. Tension pinches her face. Perhaps it is not hope that it is needed, but rage. Rage for the lives that were plucked from the sky, 
for the holes left open and undefended, for the shadows allowed to creep into our home in the pyramid's wake. She looks to the traveler. There is much to answer for. On the edge of the reef lies a wasteland called the Tangled Shore. That's where you'll find Aldrin. I won't stop you from going. As for Savala, he would cling to the broken pieces of the future he imagined until they crumble in his hand. He hasn't seen what I've seen. Ever since the Traveler woke, it's been speaking to me. Visions of crowns, roses, silver trees. <laughs> candles that turn into bonfires. And I'm not the only one. If you see something new, don't be afraid to pursue it. I wish I could help you more. But the city needs a unified vanguard. No. Or at least no. the illusion no. of one. And <laughs> this is your road now. Uh, this voice acting might actually be speaking of the current era. I'm not sure at the moment. <laughs> what are you guys chuckling out over there? I'm sitting here listening to voice acting. I hear this chuckling. What are you doing? I'm trying to do the uh, lava. The floor is lava. Oh, <laughs> the floor me. is lava. I remember that. Gonna go. Okay, so it seems that we are ready to do some Forsaken. I believe we need to go to the Tangled Shore. Ah, High Plains Blues. Well, you guys ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Robert, are you there? I just not realized I've been muted this entire time. Yeah, I'm ready. You keep muting yourself. <laughs> yeah, it's like you're trying to clear my throat. Ah, I understand. You're just trying to save it from the mic. Yeah, exactly. No problem, I understand. <laughs> I was ask. Uh, I was talking to Brianna. I was all like, um, "I'm gonna hop off here." Oh, cinematic time! And I'm gonna die. Yes, I am humbled by your gracious acceptance. Marasav, my sister, your queen, may be gone. But she is with us now, and always. As for you, my friends, my barons, you embraced me when I was cast out. And for that, I gift to you the bounty of the Tangled Shore. Go, unleash upon the fallen chaos. By your grace, Father. be proud. The Reefborn's love for their queen remains undiminished. Love is fleeting, but devotion. Now that is forever. Not one of them has ever shown more strength of devotion than you, my dear brother. The Awoken cannot be trusted. You and I know that better than anyone. Together, we can bestow upon our people the fortune they so richly deserve. Extinction.
Let us see what dreams may come. Or I missed something. Did she die somehow? She's gone missing. Oh. Nobody really knows where she is. She's presumed to be dead. Mm, that's interesting. If that's the case or not, but you'll find out. Yeah, definitely. I, I, it threw me off a little bit. I was like, uh, did I miss something? <laughs> And the way that he called him father is there's something between those two? No. That's just some uh, title that they've given him. You will see. Okay. There's... Understandable. I, I it's just it left me with questions because I was just like, what? I mean, I'm, you know, he didn't. The Tangled Shore, a lawless frontier of outlaws, scavengers, and pirates. Murderers like Aldrin and his fallen would fit right in. We need to search the shore. From the fallen camps in Quitter's Well to that ancient awoken watchtower on the horizon. Leave no stone unturned. Aldrin can't hide from us. Question? <laughs> you and your little quips. <laughs> Had to get one in there somewhere, right? We couldn't do it in the cutscene. Ikora told us cave towns are skulking about the tangled shore. It's not much of a lead, but it's all we've got. Let's get to searching. Aldrin and his gang of fallen can't hide from us. Alright, where is the objective? We search. Oi! <laughs> you about fell down in that giant hole, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> Talk about taking a spill for the worst, right? Like, it's not directing me anywhere. Where, where the heck am I going? We're just looking around. Yep. Searching. Search for it. Smell it. I believe in you. No. Oh no. Oh, I regret what I had chosen to do. <laughs> I regret the thing I did. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like you can walk on it, you know, tight rope, just like. Yeah, da, 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 da. But no, <laughs> you cannot stand on it. <laughs> you looked out, boy. Okay, well, I guess if we're just skulking around, search the tangle shore for Aldrin and his barons. Okay, but we are searching for something. Rat a tat tat, you know what I mean? That's the tiny pew pews. Ah, uh, this looks like a place where we're supposed to be. Gotta be a way forward if we keep looking. These bodies don't appear to carry the corruption, but they clearly had a run in with someone who did. I've marked a suspicious energy signature on your display might be worth checking out. Boy, you're taking a long time. <laughs> oh, sure. fancy. Well, that's gotta be something. What? <laughs> well, who did that? Not me. Y'all stasis freaks. 
<laughs> I ain't running. Look at look at the difference. Look this at our glow. Kind look of at the glow. Tunnel. That's a stasis glow. No, it's yeah. not. It is. No, it's not. I should have just aimed it a little lower, but we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> Sorry, I mean, um, I'm not admitting to anything. <laughs> oh, they're admitting to something. <laughs> Da, 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 uh, quick, uh, hold on. Yeah. Hold on. That time and oh, oh, falling. How y'all doing? I think I had you get too. Ah, uh, that. Oh wow. I am getting strong graphical lag. I may have my settings turned up a tad too high or something. Hate to do options in the middle of the video, but uh. Shadow quality, light shafts, foliage, shadows distance, let's set that to medium. I want it set Those to the highest. We fought in the prison of elders. They're spreading. Ah. Uh, I don't know, that's usually really nice. Okay. That's not much of a change, but... Ah, uh, it kind of helped. Yeah, it helped. Foliage shadow distance did a little bit. You you love your Stop spaces. blocking the way. Oh my goodness. There. Well, there how deep? Perhaps you will kill my children a better fight than your friend came. Well. Oh yeah. This is, uh, it's a lot more graphically intensive than just the, uh, game itself, you know? Well, okay, I'll, I'll reward that. This is a lot more graphically intensive than playing in the open world. I agree. I don't know why, yeah, I, I'm only getting 105 FPS They're instead sucking of my the usual out of this servitor. so... Corrupting it. You're not alone. You know, uh... We're running a 970, it's held out for a long time, but uh, I, uh, I could always use an upgrade when it comes to stuff like this. Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna change a few things. Render resolution, fully detailed, depth field. Let's set the texture too high. Oh, nope, can't change the texture right now. That would require a restart. I think that made it worse. Ooh. Someone's hacking our comms. You're late. Here I was thinking I'd be hunting Aldrin alone. It's revenge. We need to talk. Oh, that's face much face. better. I'm on my way to see an old acquaintance. Lower the level is, detail a bit, but it helped. Baron's dead as much as we do. Problem is, the feeling is mutual. So my acquaintance is laying <laughs> no. low in a hidden bunker. If we want him to open the door, we can't Get leave any in. witnesses. Clear the area. <laughs> Time I try to shoot him. Keep the wrong way. Uh, all right. <laughs> yes, so we can still get past. Finally, we did it. We did it. I'm, I'm get. I'm getting a little annoyed by that now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting here running right through the freaking doorway. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> like, oh, now he's really getting on my nerves. I just, I just wanted to get one good one. That was Back it. Up. I'm done. Oh, the past two times, I oh, didn't actually did I block you. That? That's all I wanted to do. Just one. <laughs> well, you did. Uh, oh, hello. Now we're a sunny boy. Now we're a sunny boy. Whoa, I just dropped to 70 FPS. The, <laughs> I tell you what. Here. Forsaken must have not been well optimized as the rest of the game. 
because I'm not used to this. <laughs> the game used to run a whole lot better until Forsaken came along and said, hey, Not I'm going to crap on your frames. But why are Fallen fighting against other Fallen? The score on Fallen. <laughs> Not anymore. Oh, well, hello there. I forgive everybody watching if there's any drop frames. I was not anticipating this. Game, uh, game usually runs a whole lot better than this, but Forsaken decides, ah, we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna have this. Oh, that, that was bunk. <laughs> I tossed the dagger. And I was aiming straight at this stalker, and then a wall comes in front of my way, and it bounces off the corner. Oh. All right, I'm getting kind of tired of you guys just warping away. The Baron's leader, the fanatic, has the power to resurrect oh, that's the friendly. as frenzy. Puppets, and he gave him that power. So Uldren and the Barons murder Cade, and then come here. What's so special about the Tangled Shore? That's not my secret to tell, Guardian. It's the Reefs. I'll say this. Uldren sent the Barons here for a reason. I just need to confirm my suspicions. Ah, they keep getting uh, the spiders' associates mixed up with the fallen. Honestly, I can see why. Or the scorn, that is. Nice. Mr. Combine, you might help me out with the big boss man. I missed two shots, <laughs> and he used a big ass weapon on me. Thank you. If my aim was a little better, I'd uh, I'd have gotten at least two shots in. <laughs> I'm going on an adventure. <laughs> Goodbye, Robert. Goodbye. Goodbye, Robert. Goodbye. Come back. <laughs> oh, oh my, my god! god. <laughs> <laughs> he was on a real adventure. <laughs> like that boy. That was freaking wolf. That, that was a ride. Oh, I think we all remember Mr. Spider. Shine your shoes, Guardian. You're about to meet the spider. The spider. You can see my crusty, dusty shoes. <laughs> well, if it isn't Petrovench, the worst jailer in the solar system. <laughs> what brings you to my home away from home? Away from the home. On the run, are we? I heard you lost the shore. God. You lost my shore. Thought you might want some help getting it back. A guardian? And where or oh where? Pray tell is its ghost. Never mind the ghost. There were two guardians at the prison of elders when it fell. Kate Six. And this one. The three of us want the same thing, Spider. Aldrin and his barons. Dead. Oh, what is your... Oh, ho, ho. I see. <laughs> oh, despite our clear, mutually aligned interests, I'm sorry. But I can't help but feel like it is I who will come up short. 
It's true. I know where Aldrin and his Darren scheme. You go scratch your itch. Then we can just say, you owe me. Do we have a deal? Deal. <laughs> <laughs> I know they generalize the voice actors, but it works so well for the EXO. Well, it's because it's the EXO. Yeah, it's just... Deal. I'm like, yes, it feels good. It feels good, man. It feels good. I'm glad you feel like you can relate with your EXO voice. I'm, glad. I'm sorry about you, Robert. I know you're upset that they generalized your Awoken. I feel a bit upset about it myself just because it kind of it cheats people out of their character. Yeah. And what they're used to. But yeah. same goes for business when you can't pay the voice actors or if you choose not to. It kind of change things. So to summarize what Bungie did, we paid protection. full price I have to keep that for a down. DLC expansion. What actually ended up happening was we got our, uh, shall we say, Jews content cut in half. The, the personalization options Mystics. and gear no longer matter due to sun setting. And I'll show you an example. The voice actors are gone, now just the EXO. The EXO, he's a good voice actor. I love him, but he does not fit my Awoken world. And on top of this, there are now no free raids that come with this game anymore. There used to be, there used to be one. Which, now that Robert has said that, has also kind of led to my disinterest, you might say, as to why my frequency of recording Destiny has been slow. At the same time, I'm lazy. Apparently, <laughs> I will not doubt I that fact. I will not doubt that fact. I could have still recorded. Lazy bum. Yes, but I am still lazy. That's obvious. I'm still lazy, but at the same time, my disinterest for the game comes from the way Bungie's handling it, and not many people, including us, are happy with that. See. The voice actor thing, I would have been okay with had they informed the voice actors, but they did not. Yeah. So, that's what made me a little upset. Yeah. So, we have what we have now, and... Poor investment. We're Poor just gonna investment. try and finish up the recording whenever we possibly can, you know. I don't know if I'll be getting into uh, Beyond Light. I don't think I will. But if I do, I'll record it. Save your money. Huh? What? I'm sorry, Robert. Did you say I... something? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no. I would never. It's not like I just told you to save your money. Or oh, save my money. No, it's if I'm willing to spend that money on an expansion. Why should I? Oh, expand. Is that what we're calling it? An expansion? Okay. Is it? Or is it just DLC? No, I was just making the joke. <laughs> yeah, half the planets are gone. I don't carry that heavy of an interest in Destiny to consider it. No, I see. But it's a consideration nonetheless. Mites and maybes. Mites and maybes. That's pretty much what it is. Mites and maybes. Great game and all. But their business and management of this game is starting to become real wacky. Anyways, I'm about to talk to Petra. She might have some voice acting. What can I do? Hmm, guess not. The prince lives. My sympathies, Petra turns to you. I dreamt of their passing, the worlds, those who remained, and the shadow that hung over them. I'm afraid the Dreaming City hasn't fared well since the darkness swept through our system. You can taste the difference in the air. 
It is as if there is a war being fought within smoke, bending around us and slipping through our hair, leaving nothing but scorched scent. I do not enjoy being left out of the loop, but we persevere. That's current events? Yes. Oh, well, I'll read it anyways because it sounds good. Good. As you turn to leave, she stops you. There's one more thing, a rumor she considers for a moment before speaking. The prince lives. Petra's eyes scan your reaction. Impossible, I know. But if it's more than a rumor, I don't want to hear it from the from a report. Burn it out. Okay. I'm sorry Here about we go. Cade. He didn't deserve to And my people are in ruins. Those who knelt to Aldrin, he slaughtered. The rest have scattered. But it's not too late for revenge. Here. This bow is for you. Straight from the Vestian armory. Let's go set things right. Oh, I do not have space for that. I will make space for it now. There we go. <laughs> Fudge. I would've been dead. Okay, no, 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 now no, no, I speak it to the spider. One more thing Oi. before I give you the location of the Baron's soiree. The <laughs> prison of elders continues to leak like a sieve. Someone should clean up that mess before traipsing off for murder and mayhem. What do you say, friend? Quid pro quo before you go? All right, so now we have to prove to the spider that he can trust us by completing five bounties. Zippity yay. <laughs> bounties. We all remember bounties, don't we? Fudge. Okay. So first things first. Let's see what we've got here. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Oh, you have an eye for craftsmanship. Okay. So, super kills, public events. Oh, you have an eye for craftsmanship. Chest looted. Okay. So, Robert. Yes, sir. You're still familiar with the bounties, are you not? Yeah, unfortunately, yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, we have Downpour Captain hiding in the weep in the EDZ. A quality accessory. We got Shayotet Partisan. Hunt down a prison of elders escapee hiding in the conflicts on Nessus. Fine selection. There's one on Tangled Shore in Sorix Cut. Another oh, in the EDZ. Well, I accept at least five. So there's three in the EDZ, one currently in Ooh, I should probably Tangled go Depths. Some of those. I'm just going to say if we have to wait for these guys, it's going to take us more than 45 minutes. Yeah, that's probably true. So, I would recommend perhaps a. Uh, may a have. We may. Or a montage, something like that. Well, we may have to clip. Or we'll just make another video out of it after we've done this. But. Let's try one thing first. Yeah. Let's see if we can hunt down the Prison of Elders in Sork's Cut. We'll go one by one, and if we have to wait for one, then we'll consider okay. this. So Sork's cut once here in the Tangled Shore for after the public events. So how it works, the cryopod falls to the ground, and then typically um, you defend enemies from coming in to retrieve them, and then after that, they break out, you kill them, and then that's the event. For these bounties, we have to do the heroic version, which is... I'm sure you're familiar with it, oh, getting yes. the, the cryo bits, throwing it at them, and then the whole transmits. So. Wait, did you fight any of 
Huh? Wait, who are we tracking? It's, it's the public event, the source cut. I don't remember the name, I'm sorry. His name <laughs> is Consul Partisan. Right. However, this does appear to be an event that we have to wait for. So, as for that... I am going to conclude this video just because of that fact. It will take a while for us to get these done. Um, as for another video tonight, not sure about that, but we'll think about it. Uh, other than that, uh, uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I'm going to try and make more of these videos whenever I possibly can. I'm not going to try and make any more promises to do it regularly, because <laughs> obviously, we know <laughs> I haven't been able to keep up with that. Anyways, uh, this has been Combat, Robert, and yes. Brianna. I prefer rat, because I'm really Oh, okay, I see. Radio the rat. Active. <laughs> Radioactive tornado, that's right. Okay. Hope to see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Have a good night. Good day.